This is a 100% free task management template for Notion. Watch the tutorial on how to use it so you don't email me being like, hey, how do you use it? And download this for free linked in the description. You'll get to this page and you'll click on this button here saying duplicate. If you haven't used a Notion template before, now it is duplicated to your Notion account. So this is now on your Notion account. So let's go through how to use it. There are three main features. We have time blocking, we have the calendar, and we have your task list. These three here are the most important features for a task management template. So the way to use this most effectively is actually to start at the bottom and work your way up. So here we're going to start adding all of our tasks. Write report, make presentation, and do thing. Here are my tasks that I need to do. I don't know when I'm going to do them, I just know I have to do them. Here we have my uncompleted tasks. So this here is going to show me absolutely every single task. So if I write blah blah here and then I tick this off, as you can see, I'm still seeing it here. You're probably not going to be using this tab too often, to be honest. Most likely you'll be using the uncompleted tab. So as you can see, we're not seeing blah blah underneath this tab. This is the same database, but we just have a simple filter here. And the filter is saying, only show me stuff that is unchecked. That's why we're not seeing this task here. Then we have the unscheduled. So in the unscheduled tab, we're seeing all the tasks that haven't been scheduled yet. Now, as you can see, these three have not been scheduled, and that is the next step in your task management process. What we're going to do now is scroll up and look at your week and say, when should I be doing these tasks? Now, as you can see, I don't have much going on on Friday or on Saturday, which is uh, sadly typical for a Notion expert. So what I can do here is simply drag these tasks here to when I'm going to do them. So I'll do it on Friday. And now, as you can see, it magically disappears from this list here, but it is still sitting here on uncompleted. So as you can see, the date is showing up here. That's because on the uncompleted tab, I wanna see all the stuff that I haven't completed yet. But on the unscheduled, this is for me to know what stuff haven't I actually allocated a time for. So we can either drag it like this, so I'll drag it to the Saturday, or we can even click here, so on the date, and I'll just say, I'll do this today. Now, as you can see, it's gotten removed from here. So that is the second step in your task management process. Step one, we're adding all of our different tasks that we have, everything we can think of, we're adding it here. The second step is scheduling it out. So we'll be using this unscheduled tab and dragging them or adding them to our week here. So now I know today I have to do the thing and I have to write the report. Now the next step is time blocking. If you don't know what time blocking is, it's basically planning out your day. So I'm going to say, I'll do this at 8 a.m. and I'll do this at 9 a.m. So it's literally going to let me plan this out. And if I drag this make presentation to today as well, if I do that, as you can see, it automatically jumps up here. So I can say, when am I going to make this presentation? Well, I can simply drag it down here and I'll say I'll do this at 1 p.m. This lets me plan out my day on an hour by hour basis and I can simply check these off here. Now, as you're seeing, it gets checked off here as well. That's because this database this database and this database, it's all the same database. And that is one of the most important things for an effective Notion template. You want everything connected. Basic OS for time blocking, for your calendar, and for your tasks. I hope you find it useful, or if you're ready to take the next step already, then check out Headquarters. It is my premium Notion template for task management, project management, life bucket management, journaling, time tracking, time blocking, and it has an inbuilt 80-20 analysis feature. Click on this video here if you want to check it out.